Hey guys, on tonight's video, I want to talk to you guys about my bedtime satin caps. I have two of them. One of them has the regular little soft band to go around. Let's see, it lays flat around your edges right here. And I think this is a large, yeah, or is it a jumbo? It might be a jumbo, large or a jumbo. And I got both of them from Walgreens. Here's the other one right here. It's jumbo too or large. And it has the elastic band around the edges. So I wanted to talk to you guys about both of my satin caps. And I thought about it. I said, you never talked about how you go to bed at nighttime with your natural hair. I did talk about how I went to bed in one of my satin caps when I had my tree braids, but never with my natural hair. I never go to bed. Let me not, let me not say never. I very seldom ever ever go to bed without my satin cap. I like that my hair is tucked away and off my neck and not in my face and not other good stuff. Some people don't like to wear caps and stuff on their head so they, they choose to use a satin pillow and satin sheets. I'm not a big fan of satin sheets and satin pillows because some kind of way I always end up sliding my naked butt off of them and I end up on the floor and I just in the cool and I don't like that. I don't like feel like I'm sliding around. So that's why I choose to wear satin caps. The purpose of wearing satin caps is to keep your hair protected and not dry out from the cotton sheets and pillowcases. And you know when your hair dries out, chances are you, well you, you can't break your hair off. You can't break your hair off. But it can possibly cause a little bit of damage. Not much. I don't know how, but it can. Okay, so long as you got your hair moisturized and stuff, um, you keep your hair protected from being broken off. Uh, a lot of you guys ask me, well, Nancy, do you go to bed every night with your hair twisted and braided? I sure do. Very seldom I go to bed with my hair out um, because I am a back sleeper. I sleep on the back of my head. And I um, have to keep my hair protected back here because it breaks off easier. And for years, I couldn't figure out why I had all this long hair here. And then I had a big dip in the middle back. And it looked like a W. I got a video on, on that. I'll, I'll link that to this video too. But my hair in the back looked like a W. Like long on the sides and up in the middle. Like rrr, 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 for years. And even right here, this part of my hair, by me sleeping on the back of my head, it still doesn't grow as long and stuff and fast as the other part of the hair. Because I sleep on my back. But I did, I do protect it enough to have some length back there. Okay, so that's why I go to bed with my hair twisted. And um and braid it. And I usually keep this part closed. Right here. I usually don't have a part down the middle. Well it's not really, yeah, it's kind of like down the middle, but I usually don't have a part down the middle anymore because once the hair is split up like this and not together as a unity or a unit, it just breaks, my hair should just break right down the line. But I just did a recent um, comparison video a few days ago and that's why my hair is kind of like parted in the middle. I might have to close it up tonight. We'll see. Okay, so for you who want to know, I did the LCO method and versus the moisturizing seal. Here's the LCO, which is liquid cream and oil. Look how short my hair is on that side versus the moisturizing seal. Okay, so this is Wednesday. I did my hair Sunday. So Monday, Tuesday, this is the third day. So now you see the shrinkage on this side and it's still sort of hanging on that side. Anyway, I digress. So let's talk about the um, satin caps the elastic caps how do I go to sleep with this cap some people are very concerned about the elasticity or the elastic breaking off their edges so I put my hair tuck it all the way inside the cap and I don't usually wear my satin cap around my edges like this with the elasticity elastic because I have the same concern too so usually I wear my <laughs> where my cap sort of back because I don't know if it'll break it off or not I'm not for sure but by my hair being moisturized and having oil on there it won't really break off back here because it's just going to slip back but usually the, it doesn't really slip it stays in one place that's what's cool about the elastic, elastic bands they stay they kind of like stay in one spot so when I wake up in the morning it's usually in the same spot or it might be a little cock deuce, but I don't usually have my elastic cap on my edges like this. Another reason why I don't have my elastic around my uh, edges is because I don't like stuff touching my ears, especially my left ear. 
Like I said before, I don't know what's going on with that. But I prefer for my cap to be off my ears and back like that. That way, I won't have any breakage and no ear irritation. Okay, so. I have to get the large caps because I have large hair and I have a large head. And plus, I don't like for my caps to fit tight on my head. I don't like tight stuff on my head anymore. Although I love my tree braids, I don't really miss the tension from the t from the French braids. I don't like all those tight, that tight stuff. Well, I like for my hair to be loose. All right, so we're going to talk about the other satin cap that I rock. I usually mainly wear this one because I like the soft band around the edges. Eh, I kind of like tore it right there. It's got like a little split. But yeah, so this one I like the most. And I took my hair away with this too. And if my head, if my band comes down here, I don't feel like I'm going to lose some edges. But just like my other one, I don't like it touching my ears and stuff. I like to go a little bit back. But this one tends to slide a little bit more too because there is no nothing gripping like the elastic one here. So there is no grippage. This is a large one too. And yeah, I like satin caps. I like for my hair to be tucked away because when I'm in relax mode, I don't want nothing touching me. <laughs> okay, so yeah guys, I just wanted to share that with you. And let me know what you wear on your head tonight before you go to bed. And let me know which one you prefer. You, you may like the elastic one. So, I like this one too, like for um, like when I used to wear my tree braids, because this one will kind of like cup the hair, the my braids, my and it wouldn't move. This one was too weak for that. All the you know, like if you wear a lot of braids extensions, this is probably kind of cool to have because it can hold the hair in place. So that is it, guys. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.